Hey guys, what's up? This is Shane here from Lock and T, and I'm going to show you guys how to take your downloadable drum kits and sample sounds and put them on your keyboards and beat pads so you can actually tap them and use them. Uh, so first you're going to open up Ableton Live 8 because that's the editor I'm going to be showing you how to uh, do it on. And um, the first thing you need is a, a MIDI track, just a blank MIDI track because your MIDI track is what connects your MIDI device to Ableton so you can actually tap on the keyboards and stuff. So you take your MIDI track and you go over here to your top left in the uh, live devices section and you go in under the instruments tab and then you grab a simpler and you drag it onto the track so the MIDI track changes now into a simpler and you have the simpler on the MIDI track and what this does is it allows you to drop uh, sample sounds onto the simpler so you can uh, tap them and change the octave and get different pitches and things like that. So you, to load all your sounds into the editor and be able to drop them, you go down here into this, uh, the second from the bottom, little, it looks like a camera. You click on it and this is what, this is the tab that loads all just files and plugins into Ableton so you can use them. To load them you click at the top and it'll give you all your options of where to find your files wherever you've located them. So I go to all volumes and uh, I have them all on a hard drive under a beat samples just folder so it's simple and easy. So I go under my book which is my hard drive and then uh, click on beat samples double click it and then it just opens all my different beat samples that I have. So I have um, all my different like drum kits. Here it is. Uh, Kanye West, drum kit, Lex Luger, different things like that. Just things I found online. And um, you just open these up and you should have all your sounds in there and then you can just scroll through the sounds by using the arrow keys on your keyboard. And then when you find a sound you like, you just drag it onto the uh, simpler and drop it where it says drop sa sample here. And you can actually uh, hit it on your uh, keyboard now and your beat pads if you have them hooked up to your editor. Um, when you have them on your keyboard you can actually get them in different pitches so that's like and then the deeper one would be so you can adjust all those different things and then um, down here on the simpler you can adjust when it starts so it'll start later and then it'll end later with the length you can hit the loop button and actually set it up like a loop so it'll loop itself. You can adjust the length of the loop and all that. And um, you can also adjust the settings for the sound to make the decay, like the echo, sound more on the sound. And uh, you can adjust the attack and how hard it actually hits. So you can adjust all the, these different things with the simpler. So it makes everything pretty easy. Um, and that's it. So if you like the video, subscribe, listen to all of our different music and music videos, subscribe to Maki and T and SG Productions, coming out with a bunch of new music, the N64 EP and music videos. So look out and show love. Thanks.